Let's look at lithium, the alkali metal. It's at the top of group one, and when it reacts with water, it has quite a vigorous reaction, releasing hydrogen gas and forming a lithium hydroxide solution. But if we go further down the group and look at potassium, the reaction's much more violent. Potassium is more reactive. It releases so much heat in this reaction that the hydrogen burns with a lilac flame. So why is potassium more reactive? Because it's further down the group. Well, both lithium and potassium have one outer electron, and they want to lose this to become more energetically stable. You see, atoms like to have a full outer shell of electrons. Well, what's the difference between lithium and potassium? Well, we can see potassium is bigger. This means that outer electron it wants to lose is further from the nucleus, so there's less force of attraction between the negative electron and positive nucleus. And this means the outer electron is easier to remove. And that's why as we go down the group, the elements become more reactive. Let's get to the marks.